My name is Tyler Braggington, and I'm an Applications Manager for Hawkridge Systems. Today we're going to be taking a look at how to link SOLIDWORKS Inspection Project Properties to custom properties from the drawing or model. SOLIDWORKS Inspection is an add-in product that makes it easy and quick to generate inspection documentation such as balloon drawings and inspection reports. To utilize the tool, we go ahead and begin a new inspection project on the SOLIDWORKS drawing. I'll select the default project template and now I'm ready to begin specifying some inspection project properties. I can go ahead and type general properties such as the part name, part number, part revision, and the same ones for the document right in, or I can copy and paste them from the text on the drawing. However, by simply typing these in, they're going to just be in there one time. I'm not actually creating a link. I'd like to create a link between these project properties and the actual properties from the drawing and model. To create that link, I'm going to go ahead and click on the name of the actual property. I'll begin with the part number. This will open up your link custom property dialog. Here we can link this property to the custom properties from the drawing, from the model, or configuration specific. Since this is the part number, I want to link it to the number from the actual model. I'll select number and hit OK. This will bring in the information as well as create the link. I'll repeat that process for part name part revision, document number, document name, and document revision. Once we've completed linking, our general custom project properties. Once we've completed linking our general project properties, we're ready to go ahead and finish exporting the data such as dimensions and notes from our drawing to create the inspection documentation. I'll go ahead and advance through the steps and say OK. With the data collected and the entire drawing ballooned, I'm ready to export my data to an Excel report. I'll choose export to Excel. I'll use my standard AS9102 format. And this will export all of my data into a pre-created template for my inspection report. If I take a look at form one, we can see the majority of our data has already been placed in here from that part number, part name, as well as the revision information and drawing information. This information is also linked to those properties. So if I go ahead and close down my report, and we make a change to something, such as one of the custom properties on the drawing itself, such as the part number, it should update for the actual project properties as well. I can verify this by choosing to export again. I'll choose the same template and hit OK. You'll see that it automatically identifies that a change has been made and it would like to re-perform the synchronization to check, make sure that my properties match the custom properties. I'll say OK to let it perform the resynchronization, and then I can do that export. Now when I get my report, we can see that that part number has been updated to reflect the change. Today we linked the inspection project properties to the custom properties from our drawing and from our model. This ensures that we have a nice link that always keeps us with the most up-to-date information for our inspection reports. Thanks for watching.